something at this championship happened that could never happen in a million years in any other sport, professionally, collegiately, when there's a broadcast on national television. And that was during one of the prime events, we're at the 60 meter men's final. It is one of the biggest events in the entire championship. The stream cuts out. Black screen for five, six, seven minutes. We don't see what's going on. And to make this even worse, not only did the screen cut out during a very crazy race and a race that everyone wants to see, there was already an issue that happened that, that, what, five minutes before, which made everyone wonder what's going on because there was the potential false start and everyone had to get called back. They had to run it again. We didn't know what's going on. And so not only do we have five minutes of radio silence, the screen cuts to black, we get a wide view of the entire arena, you know, one of the things where you show when you're entering into the facility, and then it, we don't see the race. The final happens, we don't get to see what happened. Uh, the only thing you get is a, a view after the fact of the, the final race. And it makes me think, where else could a major broadcaster get away with doing some crap like this? And the answer is nowhere. Do you think for one second that during March Madness or during the national championship in football or any playoff game in college sports or anything like that, that they would be able to just say, you know what? It's there, there's five minutes left in the second half. This is there's five minutes left in, you know, the championship game. It's overtime, whatever it is. We're going to cut the screen. No one's going to know what's going on. And then the only way you're going to find out what happened is through a video clip that, that get po gets posted later. Do you think that the sports world would be like, you know what? That is fine with me. I'm just OK with missing out on the entire championship. I don't care. Of course not. That's not what would happen because this is unacceptable. We had a major television broadcaster be able to not show what was going on and is just going to most likely be getting away with it. And so it was just a huge issue and a big problem. We've seen this issue in the end for NCAA championships before. What really sucks is if you go back to my old podcast, actually this exact one at the NCAA championship last year for indoors, I praised the NCAA on how great the quality was. Like this, this meet last year was fantastic. The way that they had uh, a television broadcasting where they showed just the field events during a time before all the racing events happened and you could see all the jumps going on and then they had really good shots and cameraing. They did a great job last year. And then to see the, the production value that they showed here, it's like, what the heck are we doing? Have you done this before? It doesn't look like you have. And so to see that type of thing at one of the biggest meets of the entire year is just super disheartening. And it's like, we, we clearly don't matter because you're, you're, putting, you're putting together this type of performance. We're already on only ESPN3. You're showing the other conference championships already for basketball. You're already not showing us on the regular channels. So we're already playing third fiddle here. And then on top of already playing third fiddle, you're going to make us have have a terrible production value. And it's like, do better. I know you can do better. You've done it. I've seen it. We've all seen it. You've got the money. You've got all the production values. You can do it, but you just didn't. And it was super annoying.